MustangMedic.com. We show you everything from point A to point B, day one to day soul. So enjoy and thanks for watching. <laughs> we work on your Mustang, sell your Mustang, restore your Mustang, and most of all, love your Mustang. MustangMedic.com. 1969 Mustang Coop F Code Project. All right, so the 69 is heading out of here tomorrow. At least that's the plan. So this mirror <clears throat> is uh, brand new. We purchased it, and uh, it's a make good on the mirror that got broken off uh, before. So I want to make sure that uh, Joe had his mirror put back on before he picks her up, and uh, she's heading out. So there's still a number of things to do on her, and uh, Joe's planning on handling that. So. We're getting her good to go so we can take her out. And adjustment of mirror. Oh, that's nice. Here, look at the look at the new mirror. See the new mirror, right? And now take a look at the other mirror, Carlos. You can check out the other mirror on the other side. Nice. Nice so, I guess, nice. so I guess that there are advantages to having us break parts. <laughs> <laughs> Shiny and everything. So the mirror looks really nice. He's probably going to have to get another one just to make that match and, and mm -hmm. uh, have the mirror look different. But we're going to put the uh, air cleaner back on. The uh, valve covers are on. I, I told him about the, the secondary relay that he needs to get. So he knows what to do and it's all on video uh, to direct him. So we're going to tighten up this little bolt down here. We're sticking with the old uh, air cleaner because the other one's too big to fit. And we're going to get rubber today. So the, um, the, uh, the PCV valve can connect there and also the uh, oil filler tube. I purchased some new parts and I'm going to go after them right now. We're going to get them put on the car. All right, so we purchased this. This is for the oil filler tube and we got the grommets from Star. Thank you, Scotty. Um, so we're going to install these. I'm hoping that this one works for the PVC in that in that, that size hole, but it looks kind of large, so we're going to see. I might need to get a bigger one and order that today since Joe's picking her up. Uh, so I'm going to install these right now, and we'll see what we got. And, oh, and guys, it's going to be kind of freaky because a number of cars are going to be moving on right before our move, so we're going to be having this giant space and, like, no cars. So send us Mustangs. <laughs> <laughs> and also there's possibility a possibility I'm only saying a possibility have I said possibility enough mm -hmm. of a 67 Shelby um, in need of restoration that could be coming to Mustang Medic so that is actually uh, also very exciting we're making good progress on Joe's GT and um, oh, we're, uh, not Joe's GT sorry we're making good progress on Bob's uh, GT, and uh, Wheels is working on the engine now, and we're going to be moving on that too. Our priority right now, with the move coming up, is to get the 72 back on her wheels, and uh, so she can roll out. All other cars roll or are under their own power. And yes, the 71 is under her own power. Oh! <laughs> I can't believe I'm saying that after a year of that car not rolling. She's rolling under her own power. All right, parts going on. Hey, much to my surprise, uh, Scotty got it right. Just kidding, Scotty. <laughs> Scotty watches the videos and also supplies us a lot of parts for Star. They're great with delivery. I'm very pleased with uh, the service over there. He's also humble, too, because I told him I wanted to talk to his manager to tell him how good of a job he and, and another <laughs> client, another uh, service person is doing. And they didn't, the manager didn't call me back. So FYI, Scotty. All right, so there it is. Here is the PCV valve. And she is on. That line's a little tight for my taste. I'm going to go over the top of the choke. There you go. It's a little better. All right, so that line's hooked up. So now we're working on this line. So it looks like... Uh, Joe, your car is going to be ready to go for you tomorrow.
put a, little, put a little spin on it. <laughs> Stick it in. None of that sounded good, sorry. And then, ah, denied. It's a bigger hole. This thing, this thing looks like a, oh, you know what this is? This is the, uh, this is the PCV valve right here inside the cap. There it is. It's a PCV valve cap. That's not what I wanted. All right, I'm calling Star, and that's interesting. Well, we'll use this for a future project. I'm going to order uh, the cap. There's a compressor. It's working. Um, all the hose lines charged. System is solid, so the air conditioning is going. We just uh, Joe's going to um, apparently um, get the uh, relay put on so we can actually kick her on without damaging the compressor. Very important. Do not plug this compressor back in, Joe, until that relay is hooked up. You're going to handle it. The di again, the diagram is on the uh, the video of when we got the uh, the uh, all that work done for the compressor and the air conditioning. That was quite a day for us. All right, ordering this part. Part two is coming up. We're going to wash her down and get her all cleaned up and position her so Joe can pick her up tomorrow. Thanks for watching. MustangMedic.com. Please look for the link in the description below for the next in our series. If it's not there, come back soon. MustangMedic.com. We take the frustration out of restoration. MustangMedic.com.